Hi guys and welcome back to Alan Wake 2. Technically, I went and cleaned the entire map from cold stashes, rhymes, lunch boxes, I think. I didn't find I didn't find in all the manuscript pages so far. Probably will not find them because there's a lot of them and I don't want to go just around and collecting piece of pieces of paper. So now we will all slowly approach the end, at least this is what the game told me. The last couple of items that I was able to pick up gave me the rhymes, gave me additional talisman slot. And <clears throat> the last stash gave me the entrance to the lighthouse. And in the lighthouse there was some, there was a pack, a backpack expansion, and then also I got some random stuff and, and lore and, and so on and so forth. There is a video on that on, on the channel, so if you want, it's a very short one, you can just take a look at that. So let's continue with the story. So the cold of the tree actually kills Taken. They were on our side, even if their methods are misguided and criminal. It looked right from where we were standing. Nothing's what it seems in this case. Too many stories contradicting each other. Too many versions of the truth. We have a lot of catching up to do after this thing is all over. Everything is different now. My family, me, the whole fucking world. I'll buy the coffee, Anderson. Partners to the end. This case is one for the books. I see what you did there. And now I'm sc scared or like worried that Casey is gonna die because we got very close all of a sudden. Ready to go? Yep. I'm ready to head to Cauldron Lake now. Let's get the plan started. Okay, here we go. We'll be there for you. What do you need from us? I'll head to Cauldron Lake with the clicker. Scratch, we'll try to get you, Anderson. You'll need backup. I can tell there's no talking you out of coming, Casey. Estevez, is there a way to get that light array to the lake? Oh, I've got you covered, so good news there. And we'll bring our mobile containment unit. It's specially built for entities like Scratch. And this work of art, Anderson. What's the plan for that? I'll make some calls on the way. Just meet me at Cauldron Lake. Okay. I thought that we will be just transported, <clears throat> but okay, I can I can drive there with my own car. Tor, I need the old gods of Asgard. I need a very special song. Oh. It's extremely quiet. Up? Of course. I need a song about Alan Wake. About bringing him out of the dark place. I could barely I hear got. him in my right ear. It was so quiet. Okay, Cauldron Lake. I also went back to the cauldron lake with the bolt cutters and went through the entire um, pick up, pick cabin up. area. David, please pick up. David. David, it's me. Where have you? Stop. For once, you need to listen. You left me. You took my daughter away from me. Then you let her. She's dead because of you. And I don't ever want to hear your voice again. Stop calling me. David! Jesus Christ. It's getting worse. It's spreading. I'm running out of time. 
I wouldn't say it's spreading. It's still localized, but your phone might be affected. But yeah. Okay, I'm wondering how it's gonna end, because from the information that we had had so far and we pieced together, basically Zane is the first is the first link in the entire chain. Lake shore here. Cool. So we will take the shortcut through here. Unless it's not possible because of this tree. And it is impossible because of this tree. So let's take the long road. Long, long road. So the Thomas Zane was the first in the line because then the, because Thor and Odin remember Thomas Zane or Tom Zane doing weird stuff with the world. And then Alan was the second part. So like not Marine, the second part, but the second. The lights, Anderson, where do you want them? Set them up on the shore. We need to be ready if Scratch shows up. We'll be ready. Best of oh. <sighs> on one hand, I want to fight. But on the other hand, I'm kind of scared of fighting to not waste any resources. I still have not pinned down when I need to... when I need to dodge. Still lose me a little bit. Or quite a lot, actually. We have a lot of those. So let's take two. Cool. Okay. And then there's an owl awake, like coming back to my thought. And I'm starting to think that Alan that Wake torn, Odin. is actually... I need you to meet me at the shore. Is the song ready? Almost! Odin's got a killer chorus! Drive carefully, Grandpa. <laughs> Pedal to the metal, bro. Pedal to the metal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very rock and roll way to drive. <laughs> yep. So I'm wondering if maybe. Okay, we're here. And we went the wrong way. But we couldn't go here, right? To the right. Uh, because of the way of how it was made by Tom Zane. It might be that Alan Wake is just like an alter ego. Or not even alter ego, but a different iteration of Tom Thomas Zane. Or incarnation, or maybe he's a scratch to him, or something like that. You know, the same person, but in three different ways. Okay, how do we get to this? How do we get to the shore? Oh, we can... no, we can't. There's a... here, it's a roadblock. So technically we would go alongside the water, but what? How, how does that work? What do you want me to do? And, I'm, and I can hear... oh, okay, they busted it through. Dude, I'm here! Okay, where the fuck are you? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. Just 
You know what? Fuck you. <clears throat> okay. Ah, this is the way. Okay, we can do it. Where is this dude? Where is my crossbow bolt? Oh no! Ah, god damn it! He despawned. The lights in the containment cell are good to go, Anderson. Great. A Torin Ode in there yet? <laughs> the two golden oldies? Well, they're here, and they bought moonshine. I love them already. <laughs> <laughs> they're alive. You wanted to know what art we would use? Well, that's them. I'll be there soon. Yeah. Oh. So they replenished, the game replenished the stashes that I opened before. That's One, good. Two. One, two. Are you feeling tonight? Oh, <laughs> no, go away. Oh fuck, I have to fight with you. Okay, okay, I get it. Oh no, there is a... Uh, Okay. I'm gonna use all of my healing items. I hope that there is like a... That there is a shoebox. Grandpa! Jesus, F FBC, FBI, Grandpa, everyone is working together. What a climactic scene. There's stuff in here. Good, good. I rep I'm able to. I wanted to say that I'm able to replenish, but they. They did that very sparingly. Okay, let's maybe grab. Let's maybe grab a little bit we'll more healing items. Get this. And in case everything goes wrong, let's get these as well. Do I have more of the... Yep, yeah, I have more crossbow bolts. I'm, I feel like I'm preparing for a war. Odin, I love you guys. Just give me a second. It's not gonna be easy. Okay. Just let me check everything around here. Kiddo, we're ready to rock and roll. Grandpa, you signal me when the song is done, and I'll use the clicker to bring Wake back. Hit it! Yeah. Hello, Cogren Wake! Great to see so many federal agents here tonight. Prepare Fuck, to I didn't reload. Sing, mind fry, act of black magic and sorcery. This storm goes out to our favorite tortured writer. 
Let these sweet tunes guide you out of the darkness. It's called Dark Ocean Summer Day. Okay, let's get this party started. <laughs> oh, false start. Uh, let's try that again. <laughs> okay, I got saved. <laughs> they even have a guitar player. <laughs> Fuck yeah. You know what? Fuck. What was that? Oh, I'm gonna die. I died. Jesus, that was fast. <laughs> that was fast and sudden. Come on, game. It's not that huge of an area that you need to load. I believe in you. Okay, mm. let's get this thing started. For real. A whole lot of paranational crimes happening right now. It's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. <laughs> Where are they? They there. There you are. Okay. Yes, KC. Keep it on it. On him. Why my game is chugging? Thanks, man. Hey, let's do this. Okay, he's still alive. I don't know why. Dude. Woo! Oh, why? Right. I wasn't that reloaded. Perfect, right in the head. Okay, let's heal up a bit. And top off with painkillers. Oh, you're here. Why are you... Oh, no, 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 there's too many of them. Yes, can you drink drop some health as well? Take it on the way. 
Fuck! Fuck! It's a hard one! It's a hard one. How long is the game? The, not the game, but the song. Three minutes? For real? Like proper rock track? Three and a half minutes? I hope it's not like two minutes to midnight that is like seven or eight minutes. Jesus, that would be horrible. <laughs> and awesome at the same time. <sighs> a whole lot of paranormal crimes happening right now. Let's use up some of the regular gun ammo. Where the fuck is he? Through the stone. Unfair game. Very unfair. Anderson, oh, for fuck's sake. Give me this. Let's fuck this one guy up. Is he? Yes, he is. Load it faster! Fuck. Okay. Small break. Pick it up. Can you give me shotgun ammo? Okay, yes. <clears throat> oh no! We have the swimmer, right. Anderson, trouble on the way. Anderson on the left. Okay, this one's done. Fuck, they are... Tough. Anderson, Give me the shit. Oh fuck! I missed him so badly. You don't, you don't actually, you know? Oh, this is a big guy. Fuck. I wanted to toss the lantern, the flare on the ground. It's a taffy. That's a tough one. Jesus. I need to save those. 
special ones, the big ones, for later. Could have put them the other way around. Can I move this somehow? Nope. That would be nice if I could just point them in the, way, in the direction that I want. Hmm. Where is this dude? Where he is? I have no clue. Took so much damage. Straight from the get go, I received like tons of damage. I didn't, I want to do this. Maybe I should just be in a different spot. I think that would that would be a good solution. He's fucking indestructible. <laughs> Fuck off. Didn't I just kill you this second ago? Oh, it's you! Okay, let's go for, for, for this with you. Hmm, that went well. What? What? They are usually one shot to the head and I took half a head of him. Like basically clean off. Why? <laughs> Why did you do me dirty game? <laughs> mm. Okay. How, what would be the correct way to do it? Dump this goddamn corner is not great. A whole lot of paranational crimes happening right now. It's fucking awesome. I want a t-shirt. The show's drawing a crowd. Can I? I'm gonna Taking grab one Anderson. more. Oh, I forgot that I have grenades. Dude! I have them in the light. Okay, this dude almost didn't exist when I killed him. Focus on this bullshit. 
Hmm. Why? Why were you so soft? Oh, for fuck's sake, you're, you're here. Oh no. Okay, this one's done. You man, okay, one down. Got a delivery for you, Anderson. Can I have more shotgun ammo? No batteries, shotgun ammo. Okay, 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 okay. Bro? Oh, you fucking piece of shit. I just healed. Is this a good moment? I think it is. Cool. Where is this dude? There you are, you piece of shit. more. Reload. Ooh. Oh my god. Heal. Of course, let's heal. Fuck, I wanted a shoebox and it get me the, to the clicker. Fuck. Hi, Wake. Come on. You can do it. Get in here. Make it real? So where the fuck is he? At the Parliament Tower. He needs to actually do some stuff first. Oh my god, I hope that Alan Wake will not have the this fighting sequence. He has shitty six shooter and he reloads it forever. It will be horrific. are not. Sprint. Alan, just run. Sprint like your life depends on it. I'd been here many times before. It's very dilapidated. This felt different. It's destroyed. 
it wasn't already too late. Oh, okay, I don't have a weapons here, so that's somewhat slightly reassuring. Nobody lived here anymore. Was I too late? Okay, let's take a quick look around. Maybe there is something. Especially when I hear this from the room. I really don't want to interact with it. Yet. Okay, it's all empty. There's some snarling coming from here, so maybe let's let's watch a movie first, right? You like you like the guys night nightless nights, so maybe this one will also be fun, or maybe not. Where is the writer's room? Where the hell am I? Oh, I'm not I'm not on the map, of course. But since my goal is to go to the writer's room, I don't think this is the writer's room. I... It won't end. Like a nightmare I can't wake up from. I thought I could contain Ellen in my photos, but I can't. The monster just keeps coming back. Every night. Like waves hitting the shore. I'm... I'm so tired. There's so much rage inside of him, I can't stand it anymore. God, I tried so hard. I can't. I can't. decision most of you won't understand people call me an artist but I don't care about any of that I just wanted to show the world what I see I can't keep going like I have been. It's time for a perspective shift. To go from photographer to subject. Isn't she already in subject? Like, she's filming herself. And her struggle, which is a subject of the art. Alice Wake took her own life shortly after completing her work on The Dark Place. She will be missed, but will live on through her art. Oh, okay. What follows are her final photographs. Okay, Alan will be devastated. She jumped into the lake.
that's why he turned into Scratch. Scratch tortured her until she couldn't stand it anymore. Until she broke. And all that time, she thought it was me. Scratch was still here. He hadn't escaped the dark place yet. He was scratching my edits out of return. I had seen this before. This was not Scratch. This was me. Caught in a loop. I had stopped myself trying to fix the manuscript. I was the one haunting Alice. It was always me. I killed her. to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Oh yeah. His grief made him this way. Pretending to be wake. They're the same person. He's here. Scratch. Watch out, Anderson. Estevez, Scratch is wake with the dark presence inside him. He wants the clicker. Change of plan. I'll lure him to the cell. When we're inside, lock it and blast it with all you got. Okay, how do I. How? How? Him, Estevez. How? Turning. Oh, for fuck's sake, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh huh. Can you? Can you then? Where the fuck is he? So close. Oh, I have 16 batteries for some reason. Cool. How many? How many I need? Huh? 
Oh, for fuck's sake, no! I don't know where the other are, the other ones are. Where is the fucking ammo? Yes, please. Oh, there is a. That's also a light. Okay. 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 I can see that. Oh fuck, I missed. He does not care. Not at all. Okay, let's reload first, because otherwise it's not gonna go anywhere. Okay, let's... Woo! Okay, you're here, so let's do this. And not miss, maybe. Why did they have to make those... Why did they have to make those lights to be the heaviest lights in the universe? Oh, I thought that he's stunned. Okay, let's, let's move him a little bit away from here. How do I how do I avoid that? Mm -hmm. Oh, there you are. Nope, I missed. This is not gonna end well. This is not gonna end well. Okay, he's teleporting. And I cannot leave the animation. Well, technically I can, but I'm not fast enough. Fuck. Okay, you're back. I'm not back. No, no, not like that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, is there a third one that I don't see? Because everything in games is always the rule of threes. What is that goal? What what do I have to do? How? How do I do I get inside? What is the idea here? That doesn't sound very smart. Oh, it didn't contain him. Not at all. Oh. 
but that was fucking epic. But the containment cell? I'm sorry. Wait, is it you? Not working completely. So Did it work? Casey? Oh, come Casey. on. Not Casey. Oh, come on. Not Casey. Come on, guys. He was I hate to be awesome. the bearer of bad news, folks, but it's official. Tear Fest is cancelled. Today, Bright Falls feels a little less bright. Was that Zane? The hand that caught Clicker. Was that Zane? Tom, we need to get to our next gig. We're doing this for you. Okay, why is this game chugging like that when I pick items in here? What is the problem? I'd seen it all play out. Like a horror movie I've been forced to watch. The Dark Presence held all the cards now. You need to come to me. Done. Oh, they gone. They they just drowned. Or went underwater. What? Wait, we need to talk. Did you see that? Welcome back, Wake. You are awake now, right? With the shadow out of you? Some good news, at least. Bad news is, I haven't seen a situation this fucked since the AWE in Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. I'll do anything it takes to fix this, Agent Estevez. I'm the reason this is all happening. It's never that simple. But I should have put you in a box and shipped you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. The only question now is... Are you able to fix this? I can try. Not the most encouraging answer, but we'll make it work. Scratch. The dark presence inside Casey. It threw Saga into the lake. If she ends up in the dark place, she could be there forever. It took me 13 years to get out. Zane never did. Tor and Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out. With the power of rock and roll. I saw them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. I'm immediately less optimistic about this. <laughs> the hand that we saw catching the stuff, it was an older hand, so maybe it's like Thor or Odin caught the clicker? What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the Dark Presence is occupying Agent Casey? When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he has the clicker. Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read the ending, I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. Well, you won't get very far without these. This plan is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help, but this is all on you. I got you every kind of weapon we have available. Don't fuck it up. Let me at him. I needed a car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. I have no equipment. Space. Like, literally no equipment space. And I have one arrow when I have no crossbow. The crossbow. Let's...
Okay. That uh, does not scream optimism or like instill optimism in me as well. But let's give it a go. Where can I climb up? Like, what is the way out from here? Well, I don't have a map even. Agent Estevez, can you point me in the direction that I need to go? Or is this one? Oh, this is the way. Okay, cool. I was awake again. Clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. I was back exactly where I left. A dark forest outside Bright Falls. A gun in one hand, a flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own writing. Alice, take it from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. Not get lost in the middle of the fucking woods. I don't want to fight with you, man. Oh, it did hurt so much. Half of my health. And he left nothing in return. What a... What an asshole. Okay, some painkillers. Always some... A good idea to keep those on hand. I only now started appreciating them because they work fast. And in the middle of the fight, this is what I need. Fast acting stuff. Okay. Uh, this way. Fuck. These guys. Fuck! What is the... What? Where do I need to go? Not go. Mm. I don't want to waste anything on those guys. are you here? Where are you coming from? Oh, of course. Oh, fighting with Alan is way more tense. How do I get there? Oh yeah, through here. It's so much more tense to fight with Alan. It's unthinkable. Give me everything that you have. I think I will go for a flare gun. Where the fuck is this? Oh, okay, I know where we are now. At least, at least now I know where we are. So we can just go up here. I could have gone inside and save, I think. But 
but we can also go this way. This way or the other way? Oh, fuck you! Okay. Can hear some rando, dude. But I can also just leave and not care about him. Whew. In the dark place, the dark presence went into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over weakened it, made it dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was hunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over. It turned me into scratch. Okay, they didn't do anything in here. Shame. Damn shame. I hope that they will be like, put something in here. But they didn't. Why there are no items from Saga in the shoebox? It would have been perfect. I would have so much stuff. So many healing pads or however you want to call them. Car. 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 I had to get to Bright Falls. See this. Whew, okay. We at least managed to do that. Let's see how it's gonna go from here. Because I have a feeling that Saga Casey Anderson will be a lot harder to kill than Wake. Escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my writing for years. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga, Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. I still think that it actually starts with Tom Zane. But I don't know why. If Scratch had brought the dark place here, this would take me back inside. In 2010, I had dived in. A leap of faith for Alice. With no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Now Alice was dead. Because of me. And I was going to make that leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. Ilmo was quite good at fighting. I wonder what happened with him. Another way to look at it? I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Maybe after this I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. That didn't make me any less terrified. Fuck it. Oh my god, my eyes. Oh, the searing pain of my eyes. The much Alan Wake Return, the much anticipated sequel to Departed and Inici Departure and Initiation. This is not what I expected. Okay, do I have anything? I have everything grayed out, which means unavailable. Okay, it's at the 81st Deer Fest, so the Deer Fest, the most recent one. Like in the present times. Rose. Is Rose in here? Hello, 
Muscular Brothers Book Club. This week we will review the highly anticipated new novel by Alan Wake, Return. Return is printed on a firm, high quality white offset, uncoated paper stock, making every page a true delight to turn in your fingertips. Alan Wake's brilliance is on full display with his choice of a hardcover book jacket made of a premium enamel stock with gloss lamination that is both tasteful and pleasant to the touch. Isn't that right? No, you can see the shadow of the guy. Wake set a high standard with his previous novel, but I can say without hesitation that Return contains the best and most compelling book description on a back cover that I have ever read. This book blurb is truly riveting and will keep you on the edge of your seat from start to finish. It is accompanied by a tasteful photograph of Alan Wake's home here in Bright Falls. The book weighs one pound and three ounces. <laughs> Return is a true masterpiece. Get a copy of Return. I'll give it a perfect score of five armor beers out of five. How about you? Yako. You can see the, the, the outline of him. There you have it. Alan Wake has done it again. This was the Costco Brothers book club. That was as not crazy as it could get, like, there was no craziness in there. Oh, they are there to block the restrooms, jackass. It's not Rose, right? No, it's not. The hair color doesn't match. I needed to get a copy return. of Return. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. I was inside Scratch's ending. A perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around return. As if it had just been published. Isn't really that horrible? Of course people are brainwashed, but they seem happy. For a second there I I was hoping to see Ati on the stage. Jesus, where is that lady? I want to shoot her in the face. Oh. The dude. He no longer needs the crutches. And Man Mandy May. Why are you not knitting? Your, st your entire thing was that you were knitting. You were knitting even when your hands were bleeding. Because that was your only trait. You were always knitting. have to destroy this idyllic situation. Oh, hi Elmo. We already see so, uh, saw the float that we built. Where was it? Where is the float that we built? There was one that was th there was a dude stabbing other dude. There it is. Hello. We did that. Okay. How can I get the copy of the return? Where would it be? Ooh! They even have the FBC people here. So we can't go inside. There is a copy. I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go to rewrite the ending of return. Oh man. I would move. Shit. Okay, oh, not this way. Room to stop this horror story. 
Where is the the writer's room? Is it in the witch station? No, it's not in this the witch was station. This excessive, egocentric nightmare, all revolving around a vain monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel return come true. It wouldn't stop here. It would keep spreading. What is... Where are we? It looks like the manor, the, the well... Wellness center. But is it? Yeah, it is. We have to go to this uh, attic room with the, with the spiral next to the attic room. Can we get through here? No, of course not. We have to go through. Mm, maybe. Nope. I had to find another way inside. Main door? Or it's also gonna be locked? It's also gonna be locked. I don't wanna go through the basement. There was no entrance through the basement. There is an entrance through the wellness spa. Or wellness center. Alice? Hi, Alice. What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? Actually, because Alice jumped into the lake, she probably still is in the dark place, so she can haunt you from there. Can I save? No, I cannot. Do I have to go through the entire... this entire section without manually saving? Uh, hey, what would be the correct way? Oh, not this way. For sure not this way. Isn't... Don't tell me that the twist will be that the Rose is Alice. For now. But he's very pushy. Rose, right? From the diner. How are you here? <laughs> I'm here to save you, silly. I got your instructions. I found every hidden message you left for me. In the radio, in the wind, in the forums on my Alan Wake fan site. What? No, Rose, I haven't been leaving you any messages. I get it. Yes, Alan, only a crazy person would think <laughs> you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. Right. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. Are you like a... Alice replacement or something? This is what I... Well, what I'm... What I need to take from it? Who is Rose? And the, who is Ati? Remedy has this tendency, or maybe not tendency, but this Upstairs. style of the putting room must be in the attic. random That's helpful the people were. in there. And we never know who they are, where they come from, and what is the point of them, like other than being helpful. And it's very interesting, they like... Loop around and come to cater, Tom. Yeah! I have put everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. All you need is water and Vileda. <laughs> water <laughs> is the oldest pulp. Water finds its way. What water brings? It takes away. It can be clean or dirty. It can give life or drown it. Akti. I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. How? Like... Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm. Now there's a devil in the fist trap. 
Don't be spooked by it so that shit won't start beating your ass. <laughs> okay. I'll get the door open for you, Tom. Like, yeah, we have now there Rose and go. Ati. Before we only had Ati. The matter is a stake. Now comes the end of the line. Thank you, Ati. Can I hug you? That should be an option, just to hug Ati. Writer's room. I needed to write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. Plot board. I needed an ending that took everything already in return and extended it into a conclusion that would save us. Only the perfect ending would work. Eternal Deer Fest. Okay. The novel return come true, my final divine work of art. First granted to the people of Bright Falls, and over time it would spread, the celebration reaching everyone. Okay, that's cool. We don't have an ending yet. Is there anything in this room? No. So let's write. Return's ending was an eternal deer fest that would keep spreading. Given time, Scratch would plunge the world into his nightmare. I had to stop that from happening. I had to write one more chapter for Return. Chapter. A ending that would save us all. Who was the only one who could write it? Everything depended on this. On me. Any second now, Scratch would burst through that door to stop me. Every plot thread dangled in my brain. It suddenly felt impossible. Something stirred in the room, coming to me. An idea. One chapter. It's a lot. One page. Uh, maybe. In a horror story, there's only victims and monsters. If there is Aero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I won't let the horror story take Logan and Casey. They were dragged into this. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. The ending will have to be dark no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost. And the hero must pay the price. The scales always need to balance. Okay, we got an ending. The dark horror ending. To save them all, the hero must pay the price. Again, Alan will sacrifice himself. It's a quite... I would say that it's quite a, an interesting loophole, because... At first, Alan sacrifices himself, lands in a dark place, and now he also will sacrifice himself, or someone will sacrifice themselves, and they will land in a dark place, and this is like a good starting point for the next part, like next part and next part and next part, if they decide to make it. Something felt different. I'd never seen myself in a vision before, but it fit. Saga and I were both at the center of this story. She was now my co-author. This was the beginning of the end. We were characters in a horror story, charging blindly towards the finale. We still didn't have everything we needed. This would not work without the clicker. Oh, okay. I didn't expect this part to be going for so long. But I will continue it. We are taking this all the way to the end. I'm not gonna make another part. Unless we go like over two and a half hours, then maybe. But I don't I don't think that we have that much to finish that game. Oh. 
What's going on? Hi, Saga. Am I in the field office? No. It's the mine place. I can't leave. Why can't I leave? I think you're dead, you know. What is my goal? Look away for a way to le leave. Okay, we have TV. Nothing's working. Oh. I can't think straight. Radio? The radio is not working as well. Where is everything? Oh, everything is gone. <sighs> Profiling? I can't sense anyone. God damn. Calm down, Saga. Just think. My work is gone. You have new work. The Figure out your own shit. Casey. Stole the clicker from me. The last thing I remember is him throwing me into Cauldron Lake. I'm in the dark place. I'm lost. I don't know how to get out. I don't know what to do. Thorin Odin will just me. drop in. Was it? What? Failed who? What's happening to the case board? This is the dark place. I'm in danger. I have to get out of here. Scratch took the clicker. Scratch threw me into the cauldron lake. Other saga. I'm in a dark place. I'm I'm lost. I don't know how to get out. I don't know what to do. She's right. Cauldron lake is the is the gateway to the dark place. I'm in, I'm the, in dark the dark place. place. I'm lost. I don't know how to get out. I don't know what to do. Find evidence. Find evidence. Other saga. Let's profile our selves, our inner demons. The board says I failed them. Who's them? I let everyone down. Logan, Casey, myself. David. This is my fault. Don't forget about your name. Your my your husband. Dead. My partner was taken over by a monster. I'm trapped in a dark place. Powerless. I'm not powerless. What is happening here? This isn't me. I'm a failure. This is what I deserve. Hmm. <laughs> it's called the soul. It's called called low self-esteem. Let's think about my daughter first. I neglected my family for my job. I was too thrilled by the cases, the mysteries. I liked how dangerous the work was. And now that danger has destroyed my family. It killed my daughter. No. Where do I put that? I am a terrible mother. Ah. I let my daughter die. What is the stuff that I can click on? Like, I still have this thing active. Casey. Casey depended on me, and I let him down. I wasn't watching his back. I got wrapped up chasing the wrong lead. He feeded me. Now he's turned into a monster. He needed me. Scratch took Casey, and it's my fucking fault. Casey is the. We can profile Casey. The story. Why? My life, my family is just part of a book. Another white asshole deciding what I get to do, how I get to do it. He took my daughter from me. I'll never be free of this story from him. He used her. I'm not the biggest fan of what just happened. Because this story was pretty cool so far and they had to play the race card. Well, well I get it. She is of a minority descent and so on but i d it has nothing to do with her being in like any type of 
uh, other skin color or whatever. Or being a woman. Logan is dead. She's not dead. God damn it. Will we have... Oh, they are getting darker and darker. Okay. No! I'm done with this. <laughs> it just keeps coming back. Something's very fucking wrong here. Scratch. Oh, he erased. He's using Casey now. Like he used Wake. Oh, that's a cool picture. That's a cool photo. Why is this happening? That's a great photo. I never should have trusted these. We got all of those back. That's awesome. Do we have... Yes! Casey was being corrupted and I did nothing. Injury report. Subject seems physically weakened with some confusion about his whereabouts and even con 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 <laughs> and, and events. Concussion? Similar symptoms to those becoming shaded individuals. Exposure to the shadow is suspected but not confirmed. You knew he was hurt. You knew the dark presence did something to him and you didn't care. You only pretended to care when it was convenient and the second he became a liability, you let Scratch have him. Scratch was wake. How could I miss that? Transcript of interview with subject Alan Wake, suspected paratilitarian. Mr. Wake, you have been taken into FBC custody and will receive an in-depth interrogation at a later date, but for now I need to ask you anything you can tell us regarding the incident at the hotel. Anything you, we may need to know. There is a force here you don't understand, a presence. It's after me. It, it wants to consume me. Consume everything. Yes, you mentioned this dark presence before. There were so many hints. How did you miss the Wake was scratch? It was right under your nose. No nose. Wake was scratch. Scratch was the wake. Scratch. Wake. Scratch. Wake. Scratch. Wake. Okay. Let's get some more evidence. Mom. Coffee. Where are you? Oh hi. This case. This room. Is any of it even real? Not. Not really. It's your mind palace, and you know that your mind palace is not. Actually, nice real. Logan and David love that show. Their weekly ritual. Okay, nothing new here. I took Logan away from the father. What is this? This has all been hallucination. Oh. Wake was scratched all along, I had no idea. Wait, what? I ignored the fact that the dark presence was affecting Casey. It feels like I'm trapped in a nightmare. Stuck in an echo chamber with all my fears, my doubts, my insecurities. I used the manuscript pages as a, as a crutch instead of doing my job. It will be for terrible detective. That's not... No. Okay, I need more. I spent too much time away from Logan. Oh, hi. It was so obvious the Koskala brothers were behind the cult. I never should have left Casey at the hotel by himself. Logan. The horror story used her. Casey was hurt. I no. should have been watching his back. We can get more from the same stuff. Okay. The cult was just the beginning of the spiral.
Okay, we got some more evidence. Now let's see. There is no way out. There is way out. Don't cry about it. I was a horrible partner. This one goes what the here. Hell? Also he Oh no, he got hurt. Logan's Logan de Logan's death broke something inside me. Alright, this Come is on. what lost my mind. I abandoned my partner to investigate on my own. I hate this, but it's all true. I had tried to silence these thoughts. Focus on the case. But I can't escape them anymore. I'm drowning. I need a way out before I'm dragged under. Ilmo and Yako were running a cold under your nose, so I guess this is for being a terrible detective. What the fuck? Logan was alone. Okay, let's jump to the profiling. No. There has to be a way out. I need a way out. Oh god. None of this is real. I've lost it. I'm not even here. The mind place isn't real. A case about supernatural darkness. I'm having a full on psychotic break. I dragged Logan away to a tin can in Watery. She's dead because of me. There has to be a way out. I wonder if there's no more clues to find now? Ooh, no. yes there is. I'm not reading anymore. Okay, let's get some more doubts in me, because that sounds healthy. Scratch was too much for us. I should have made KC stay behind. Oh. My badge. Never should have taken this case. Okay, what do we have here? I always put work first, so this will be a terrible mom. Hmm. No, no, no! This is him being hurt. Okay, it looks pretty full. It's too much. It's crushing me. I'm lost in this darkness. No, it's still one of each more. But this will be the optimistic thought that we will get from the profiling, I guess. We will get start getting the good resu results, I think. Ooh! That was new. That was... Wow. They really know how to set the mood for the stuff. I need a way out. It's over. There's no point trying. Everything is lost. There's no way out. No way to fix this. There's no way out. I'm stuck here forever. This is how depression sounds my like. Past. My guilt. My mistakes. Ooh, dear. Hi. You're cute. I'm not getting anywhere. I'm stuck. But this is my mind place. My mind. Everything I need is here. It, it has to be. Of course there is. There's always oh. something. The lights. No. No. I'm not giving up. Focus, Saga. The answers I need are here somewhere. I just have to look. Hello. Oh. Yes. Hey. Positive thought. Saga. Just calling to say thanks for your note. Oh, 
sometimes I just get in my head too much. So, thanks for pulling me out. You're really the best, Ma. Really. Okay. Talk soon. Saga, for what it's worth, I think it's important that Logan grows up seeing you do what you love, what you're great at. That will teach her so much. There will be times just like this when you question your choices, your competence, even your own sanity when things get dark. Remember to trust and love yourself as much as your family does. You won't be perfect, but I know you'll be amazing. Love you always, mom. Yep. Uh, look, look, after Brand left, it was, uh, well, well, I was in a, was in a bad, bad place. place. You dragged, dragged me to those dinners at your, your house with your family. family. It really, it really uh, uh, meant a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh? We get a little bit more light. In the arm. It's just, just part of the job. <laughs> if you're gonna keep you're fussing, fussing, you can get the hell out. Look, Dad, look, Dad, look, leave the whiskey, whiskey. I saw this online and it made me think of you. Okay, what are you doing? Don't make a big deal out of it, Mom. No hugs, no hugs. you a charm bracelet for good luck. I made a matching one for me, so bring me back something cool from Washington. Mm. Positivity. Surround yourself with it. I still, I'm still missing one, right? I have what? One, two, three, four, five, and I need one, two, three. I need six. Where is the sixth one? Yeah, there you are. I am honored by the support. Thank you. Thank you. While our agency must continue to improve, the work we do here, protecting communities, pursuing the truth, it's the most important work there is. What do we have? A commendation I received from the FBI. So this goes in I here. I can't let this place make me question myself. I know what I'm doing. If I were a bad detective... I have no idea what I'm doing. If I were a bad detective, I'd probably be dead by now. Blaming myself for past mistakes won't solve the case. Logan isn't anyone's plot device. She's my daughter. And she's not dead. My daughter. Dead. She is dead. My daughter. didn't save her. My daughter isn't dead, and I won't let some bullshit story convince me that I let her die. It's not too late. I can still save them. No matter what I do, someone will get hurt. I don't know what to do. I'm afraid. I'm my own worst enemy. The fears in my head are stopping me from trying. From leaving. I might not be the best perfect mom. Might be the perfect mom, but I've done my best. Logan loves me and I love her. That's good. That's good. What do we have here now? Our job is dangerous. Casey himself told me that. It's no one's fault. It's my fault. It is, it is. I wish I'd been there for Casey, but I know he wouldn't want me to blame myself for this. We can't control every outcome. He taught me that. Casey trusts me. I know he does. I'll just 
just let him down again. I might not always be the best partner, but Casey trusted me. He would he wouldn't give up and ne neither will I. Casey's still in there. I'm sure of it. It's okay to be afraid. But I can't let this end here. I can't. I can't. I can't. I just I just want it to stop. Giving up won't make this stop. Logan needs me. Casey needs me. I haven't lost it. Uh, I haven't lost it, at least not yet. This is all real. The place wants me to doubt myself, but I can't. I still have work to do. I haven't fi failed them, and I'm not going to. There's still time to fix this. I'm so close. The dark place wants me to hate myself. But I just need to get inside my own head. Come on. Let's fix you, Saga. I've made mistakes. I'll make more. But I can do better. And I can start by leaving this room. I'm afraid it will hurt. But nothing will hurt more than not trying to save them. It will hurt. But I will fight. That's the good mindset. How do I leave? I can leave by overcoming my doubt and fears. The dark place tried to trap me here. The only way to leave is facing it head on. Wake called it a nightmare. I need to dive into that nightmare and find a way back home. Case closed. The dark place tried to weaponize my anxieties against me. I won't let it turn me into a Taken. I'm stronger than that and Logan needs me. And we received everything back. Oh yeah. I missed only three of those radio stuff and I missed none I have all of the t TV shows and now let's leave not through that door because this is closed let's leave through the ta the tele this this door Estevez. Yeah, now we're in a dark place. Come home. Oh, the, the phone hey, location call changed. Ringing. Somehow I knew the call was for me. Oh no, I was turned around. Okay, it's the same. This the same phone. Hello. <laughs> the ending? A shoebox? Who is this? It's me, but from the future or from the past. Tim. Can I find Tim? For real? Yes. Agent Anderson. Is that really you? Sorry, this place likes to play tricks. Sheriff Breaker? What happened to you? How did you end up in the dark place? I was brought here. Snatched away from the morgue by a man named Orland Dorr. Been trying to piece it together for... Well, it feels like a long time now. Who is this door person? He's here. Somewhere. I've been seeing his face in my dreams for years. <laughs> this whole thing is insane. But he is much more than he seems. 
He's connected to all of this. I need to get to Parliament Tower Plaza. Do you have any idea where it is? This place, it's like trying to find your way around in a dream. I've been trying to map it, but it keeps looping and shifting. Like there were many versions stacked on top of each other. There is a page. Describes Dor finding his way through this place. I tried to follow the steps, but no luck. Yeah, can I can have I it? Can I see that page, Tim? Of course. In fact, it's the page I tried to give you back in the morgue in Bright Falls. Huh. Now that I think about it, maybe Dor brought me here to keep you from reading it. Here. I'm gonna keep looking for Dor. The closer I get, the closer I feel to waking up. I need to find the man behind the curtain. Warling Dor walked across the rain-slicked tiles of Caldera Street Plaza. He stopped at the door to the construction yard. A poster for his talk show hung there. He stepped through, willing it to take him to Parliament Tower Plaza. I know what I need to do. The door to Parliament Tower Plaza was at the construction yard. Warland Dor walked across the rain-slicked tiles of Caldera Street Plaza. The rain didn't seem to touch him. He sensed his steps were being observed, documented into the story. He allowed it, this one time for this one reason, to be passed on by his unwilling disciple to read at the right time. The ocean that was the dark place took the shape of New York City, drawn for the mind of Alan Wake, in part for the writer to navigate his prison, in part to torment him as he struggled to find his way out. Dor was not bound by the rules as Wake was, he came and went as he pleased. For now, Dor entertained the writer's fantasy, for a purpose known only to him. At the edge of the plaza, he stopped at the door to the construction yard. A poster for his talk show hung there, another part of Wake's fiction. He stepped through, willing it to take him to Parliament Tower Plaza. That's interesting. This is the first time I've seen a page about Warland Dor. Who is he? A door that stands between two rooms is in both. A door that can lead anywhere is everywhere. That door is the center. He governs the currents of reality. With all the powers mixed up in this, it's hard to know who's playing who. Opening too many doors. <laughs> this isn't important right now. I can look into it later. I still have, like, I still think that maybe he is the father because everything is connected in here. But she, he cannot get into her mind place because he's not the descendant from the Thor, Odin, and, and so on. So he might have a different type of power. The page describes him moving through the door. How can I do that? The dark place has many faces. And many names. It is a mirror, reflecting all possible realities. The family of doors have the power to shift between these realities. Here and elsewhere. If I can find a way to navigate through this nightmare, maybe I can find a way to get back home. I have so many stuff, so much, like so many people, so much stuff. Find the door to the construction yard. Well, these door look important. I understood what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. There is light and here is darkness. There is guilt and there is atonement, but the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. There is a long journey through the night back to the light. It's not a lake, it's an ocean. Ooh, I've been here. It's like a trip down memory lane. I am a little bit tired of fighting at this point. Let me just experience the story uninterrupted for, for a moment game, please. Please. 
there is a poster, right? We need to get... Oh, not like this. Here I can go. And leave. I made it. I need to get up to the street and find that statue. You let me down. You Enough already. You're not real, right? Yeah, you're not. Okay. How about you? Are you real? No, you're not real. This guy looks suspicious. There's the shoebox. The clicker. And the and light kind of bullet. Shining with light. How oh, you're real. You're very real. Should I? I think I need to be running towards the parliament power. Right? Fuck, I'm missing so terribly. Oh, come on, don't do me like that. I just killed the fucking scratch and you're gonna kill me here. Oh, come on, game. Just give me a break. Just a small break, please. I just noticed that this is not how the story goes. It was the same thing that appeared in the Alan Wake 1 when you died, if I remember correctly. Where's it gonna put me? I made it. Oh, okay. I need to get up to the street and find that statue. Not that far away from from where I actually died. Hmm. Give me everything. Can I get in? I can't. Okay, so I need to fight you guys. Escape the dark place. Oh, okay, this is impenetrable. How can I escape it? Where is this dude? There you are. And I don't have a fucking lantern, a uh, flashlight. Oh. Okay. Oh, I see. But I don't have any batteries right now. Do you want me to do it? Hmm? What it is that I need to do? How do I escape the dark place? How do I even do anything when I don't have my batteries? Let's maybe that will despawn yes. the enemies, please. Hello. You don't know me, but you need to listen. Hold on. How did you know the clicker would be there? This is important. Alan's lost. He doesn't have the ending. He needs your help to finish the story. How am I supposed to help him from here? Okay. 
Okay. I'm in the dark place. Wake is in Washington. I could talk to him in overlaps before. My mind place is more powerful than I ever knew. I can try to contact him. <laughs> Let's do it. My mind place. I've reached out to you like this before. But I understand more about it now. You see a visions too. I used to think they were ideas, inspiration, but they're real. Just like this now. I try to use them to make the story come true. So this is coming from both of us. Maybe that's how we could communicate in the overlaps. We could use this to stop Scratch. First, I need the ending. <sighs> so there's a problem with the ending? I don't have the ending. Hmm. It has to be perfect, but I don't have time to figure it out. I don't know what to do. Fuck. I'm so sorry. This whole thing is a fucking mess. I agree. But we can still figure this out. And what exactly does perfect mean? The elements of the ending need to come from the story's pre-existing parts. To make matters worse, this is a horror story. Someone has to die. So the ending has to be earned. Set up by the story. You can't build a case without supporting evidence. That's the only way to make it stick. You don't need to tell me this is a horror story. Right. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. There must be a way to bring a hero into the story. If there is a hero... They will Even if a horror story, there is always a... Virgin dot. I can't let the horror story survive. Casey. The sur surviving innocent in virgin. They need to survive. Non negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. I have an idea how to help Casey. He's a real person who I twisted into a character. He isn't my creation, so he isn't a suitable host for the dark presence. I can write that into the ending to drive that fucking thing out of him. How did Wake know about us, about Saga and Casey? Yeah, it might have been just like a random thing, but yeah. Well, if the ending has to fit the story, this is how I see it. Return is a story about a story that comes true. And I'm a character in the story. Not just a character. The hero. Okay, a hero. <laughs> in any case, I've been through hell to be here. And this is my life. It feels earned to me that I rise above the story and be there to create the ending. Yes. That's what we're doing. Here, now. We're figuring out the ending. I it's need so to fucking meta. This isn't Scratch's ending, but this isn't your ending either. This is our ending. You aren't the only one deciding these things anymore. You're right. I can't do this alone. Every time I write, things only get worse. You beat this thing back in 2010, Alan. And here you are doing the same again. You're a hero too. We're in this together. Then let's bring it home. The ending will have to be dark, no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost, and the hero must pay the price. One of the heroes. The scales always need to balance. Hmm. 
Fuck it. Let's go with this. Are you sure? There's no time for anything better. Scratch could be here any second. Then that's our ending. I have the clicker. I'll find a way to get it to you. And I'll get the pages down. See you on the other side. We are both in the dark place. We are both in the same on the same side, in the same place. Enter the I fountain. I need to retrace my steps back to Caldera Street Plaza. I arrived in the dark place through the fountain. Maybe I can leave that way too. Oh, okay, I ran the wrong way. Ah, there are so many shadows. God damn it. I am hauling ass. Shut up, ungrateful brat. Oh, fuck you. Get me out of here. That was intense. Alan? Saga. I finished it. The ending we talked about. I have the clicker and the bullet of light. Let's do this. I have to be the one to do it. I feel like I've always been on this journey. Okay. It must end here, this darkness. What lies under the surface now shifts. A play of shadows catching my eye, thrusting my face into the water. He's here. It's shockingly cold. Past the mirror of the surface. And I will see. Can I see? The end. Scratch. Now. A white searing light of truth that for a flash pierces the shadows and reveals the hidden horror. And in that moment of silence, the whispered message finally heard. Come on, you motherfucker! Come on! Come on! What if there's nothing waiting to be revealed? The play of shadows fool us all, subterfuge to get our price of admission. Darkness not as a monster, but as emptiness. But none the wiser. No answers, no truths. The hero turns to look inside. It's destroyed by what he sees and is redeemed. Saga said we're both heroes. I'll pay that price. So will she. We are here to kill the monster. I pray nothing comes after this. Nothing will sleep. This is how we win. Is it too easy? What if this is still the dark place? Another dream to wake up from, always coming back to the beginning. The memory of what came before burned away by this terrible realization. Maybe it's a mercy, forgetting. To know nothing when we loop around, back to the... This is exactly how I imagined his inner dialogue or monologue. Just go. It's, he got shot and everything just went quiet. Perfect. Over. Anderson. She might be asleep, you know, she's a kid and it's pretty late at night. What a fucking amazing game! Jesus! The went the longer it went, the better it got. Oh my god. Everything... I, I cannot find anything bad to say about that game. Okay, sometimes it was buggy, you know, like... Collision was not there, or I could just not pick... The, the, the item pickup prompts were a little bit off, or whatever. 
But that was a fucking game of the year, or like at least a couple of past years. I don't think I played such a great game since Control. And both playing with Alan and playing with Saga felt so distinctly different. It felt so, so amazing. It felt like... Saga had an FBI training, so she had a lot of guns, a lot of abilities, and she just kept on shooting and, and destroying everything on her way. And Alan was just some random writer dude, and fighting with him was messy. It was always close quarters, and not only because of the weapon that he had, like six shooter against Saga's 18 bullet Glock or whatever, she was, she was like FBI issued weapon but also because the level design when we were playing a saga it was everything was open everything was beautiful everything was like more about exploration finding solution to the puzzles finding stashes finding uh lunch boxes rhymes solving riddles and so on and so forth and when she was playing she could use crossbow she could use the hunting rifle because everything was very di in, at a very long distance from her she could just stand there and shoot and unload and kill everything and fighting with alan was always because he was like in a small corridors small spaces everything was packed and everything felt chaotic and dirty and and very visceral because of of that everything that this game was so well thought and well designed and everything was just perfect and I really loved the moment when we started getting the at first Alan was the horror part Saga was the combat part and that was established and then at, at some point in the game it switched we like when we reached the um, the wellness and the all elderly people house it was Saga was doubling as horror because Alan was not available. So they had to put the horror somehow in the, in it. And that was an amazing idea as well. Let's try and speed things up a little bit. So maybe we can get like a post credit scene. And also the ending, when she shot and this like inner monologue of, of Alan was, was there, and then it stopped. Perfect ending. He was like impossible for him to stop thinking. And he stopped. This part is just for you. After the haunting started, I got in touch with an organization that was still looking into what happened in Bright Falls. I went to their offices and... something happened there. After I got home, I could suddenly remember everything. I remembered being trapped inside that lake. A dark ocean with, with echoes of myself. My, my, my fears, my photos. Inside a dark tide of, of madness, the same events and images looping again and again. And then I saw a light. Your light. You dove in just as I swam out. You never drowned. And you're still there reaching out. That is what the haunting is. I can see you because I've been there too. I chose to come back to the dark place. That is why I put on this exhibition. I had to mislead you. So that I could get you to where you needed to be. The only way out of your loop is destruction or ascension. Light or dark. And we've covered the destruction part many times over. And we're getting to the ascension bit by bit. Time means nothing here. You'll still need to go through the loop. But I will keep showing you the images you need to see. The light you need to see. Until you're ready. Ellen. I think we're getting close. You fucking master manipulator, you. 
it's not a loop. It's a spiral. It's a spiral. Yes! Oh! What a fucking amazing game! Jesus, let's maybe... Maybe there is, like, because of Marvel, post-credit scene to post-credit scene. But, oh my god! Remedy, you did it again! You beautiful bastards! I fucking love that game. And only now... Like, now the only thing is left is wait to for, for the DLCs and play through the DLCs and be amazed again. Because they are gonna kill it. I believe in them. Not a single regret in me for buying this game. Oh. And music, don't like everything in this game. Sound design, like localization, the whispers, they remind me, that it, they were done so brilliantly that they actually remind me of uh, Senua Hellblade, Senua Sacrifice. And I'm waiting for this game also so much. So, whew. Oh my god. All in memory of Lance Reddick, Brett Madden, and Sammy Valtaco. The journey through the night continues. <sighs> oh my god, guys, thank you so much for joining me on this journey. I will I cannot wait to get the DLCs for that game. They They knocked it out of the park. I can't express how much I love the game. I would fucking I was cons I have a couple of tattoos from the games and I'm considering getting this one as well or not even this one but control and like maybe remedy logo because they are fucking amazing. Yeah. Okay guys. This is it for now and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.